There are many ways to select Subboom Base 2 presets and in this short video I will explain how it all works. You can do it the classic way by using the up and down arrows in the preset part for selecting the preset and by using the up and down arrows in the bank part for selecting the bank. But just like all our other plugins we have the quick browser which is located here too. It opens if you click the mouse button while being over the preset name. With the quick browser feature you can quickly go through all the banks and presets. This will also remember the last 8 presets you have selected in recently browsed. This is great if you search for the right preset and suddenly realize that one of the presets you have heard before was the right one. The quick browser is an essential tool for saving time whilst making music. If you like a preset you can add this also into the favorites folder. For this use save current preset in favorites. It copies the preset into 001 favorites bank folder. These favorites presets also can be selected in this menu. 256 presets can be stored inside this folder. So this is how you can select and work with presets from the main menu and easy page. But there is more. If you click the button here the bank manager will open. It adds total overview of all presets, bank folders and some very cool features and functions you can find here. At the right side you can find all bank folders included the favorites I have just shown you. Below the bank folders section you can find functions for the bank folders. For instance to be able to create your own bank folder. In the top of the bank manager you can select several pages. The preset manager you need to select to see all the presets in the current bank folder. Behind each name you can see a star and if you like a preset you can give it a star. This makes it easier for you to look back and find interesting presets in each bank folder. If you click on the star symbol next to the preset manager button only the start presets are displayed in this bank folder. At the end of this video I will explain how you can export or backup your star selection and I will tell you the location of all the banks. At the bottom of the bank manager page you can find several functions for the preset files. You can copy a preset, rename it and so on. On the top of the bank manager the find preset button helps you to find a preset if you remember parts of the name. In search category makes that you can search on types of sounds. For instance analog bass sounds. The presets in this category pop up and the ones that have different color background are the ones that appear in the bank folder which is shown at the right side. If you select another preset the bank folder also appears at the right side that holds this preset. So the location of this preset is also clearly shown. The set category button you need to use if you make your own presets and want to give them also a tagging. In the middle part several functions appear and if you make a selection of tags press apply and save to add these tags to the selected preset. By the way if you have created your own preset use save preset as to save the preset in the current folder. If you have already created your own folder and did create a new preset while being in another folder, use save preset in folder to select your folder or another folder to save this preset. Ok now back to the star system of the bank manager and the location of the banks and presets. Because if you install Subboom Base on a new system or you would like to exchange your start selection or your own presets and banks, this is what you need to know. On your PC it is My Document, Rob Happen, 
Subboom Base 2 Bank Folder. And on Mac, it is Applications Rob Papen Subboom Base 2 Bank Folder. In this folder, you can find all the bank folders included the Favorites Bank Folder and a text file called star.txt, which holds your star info. So copy and back up your favorite bank folder and any other bank folders you have created in case of a fresh install or if you like to copy them over to your second music system. Note that you also can see a folder called original bank folder. In case you have deleted the original folder by accident in the main bank folder, you can copy from there the folder back to the main. 